Hello everyone. I'm Sajawal Ayaz with my new project online examination system using Java server pages. I've developed using IDE net means as I'm, I have selected my project and I click run button. So my project has been started. Uh, I'm writing my username and password I clicked login button here is my backend panel I'm admin so my admin panel is here first of all I have profile button then courses then questions then accounts in my profile my name email contact city and address I can edit let's edit my edited mail at mail.com now my e email has been edited uh, I click courses here I can add new course I can view all courses all the courses which has been added here if I'm going to delete any course then pop-up appears on top of my screen are you sure you want to delete this if I click cancel then it remains here and if I click OK then my course has been deleted I'm going to add course again online teaching total marks if I'm going to set total marks 20 and exam time let's 10 minutes when I click add my course has been added total marks 20 this is courses section I can add new course I can view all courses I can delete any course at any time I want this is questions section I can I can see all questions from any course that's I have selected C sharp and when click show then there are questions in this course and I can see all of these this is question number and this is a question and these are the options this is correct option I can delete any question if I press delete then question has been deleted let's see yes question has been deleted now I can add any question let's add a question to C sharp Add new question, select course name, your question. All these are options and this is a correct op option. I added a course, sorry, I added a question. So I can see my question is what should I do? You should know what to do. I don't know I am sorry I know nothing you should know what to do okay mujhe hi pata hone chahiye main kya karu and uh, the fourth option is accounts and in account section I have all the students registered with me I can add new student there is a registration form for a new user Mohan Sehra address and uh, when I click register now and a new student has been registered with me name Jazib email address city and address I can delete any user at any time this is admin panel profile courses questions and accounts I'm going to log in as a student now Jazib new user edit and uh, its password so I'm logged in as a student now it's student panel profile same page as an admin profile page your name email contact city address I can edit I'm going to next page exams select course to take exam I'm going to select C sharp course and I'm going to take exam for C sharp 
I clicked when I click take exam uh, then here is a timer timer has been started question numbers question number one question number two and question number three uh, what is true about C sharp C sharp is object oriented uh, deductive procedural functional C sharp is object oriented programming language my question is what should I do you should know what to do I know I don't know I'm sorry I know nothing you should know what to do does everyone loves the, love this language yes no depends on person language selects a person I know everyone has his own choice it means depends on a person but I'm going to select a wrong answer so I have to check the logic of a result when I press done button then result of recent exam result is I have passed this exam so I can see all results in my results section date of a re result course name time start time to end time and status action can there uh, in action there is a details button when I click details I can uh, get result details that what was the question and uh, I selected answer this and correct answer was this so status of the question was correct correct it was incorrect I selected language selects a person and there was the correct answer depends on a person this is the whole online examination system uh, with two panels student panel and uh, admin panel hope you will love this and please like my video subscribe my channel and comment below thanks